This conference will now be recorded. Hi everyone. We will now have an introduction to data science. What is data science? We Indians are always interested in the definition. So let us start with a very simple definition. Let us start with a very simple definition. Data science is the science of collecting, storing, processing, describing and modeling data the same five terms collect store process describe and model are written at the bottom also suppose i am interested in studying the pattern of occurrence of corona now everyone talks about corona suppose i want to study the pattern of occurrence of corona in the entire country and then i have to collect data from the various states as the central government I have to store all such collected data and then I should do some sort of filtering, merging and all. And then I should come up with some diagrams like a bar chart or a pie chart so that people can easily understand what I want to convey. And then I have to prepare some model so that I can predict what will be the count, what will be the number of people who will be affected by the end of this month, by the end of next month, and so on and so on. Now, if you want to enter into the field of data science, what are the various skills that you should pick up? You should learn certain portions of mathematics and statistics. You need not learn everything that is available in mathematics and statistics. Certain portions of mathematics and statistics that are relevant for data science. For example, algebra and calculus are relevant for data science. Similarly, probability and inference are relevant for data science. And you should also pick up programming skills, especially the programming skills related to Python programming language that is considered as the choicest programming language for data science because many built-in functions thousands and thousands of built-in functions that are exclusively meant for data science are available in python and you need not worry about this aspect now data science is mostly used in banking domain insurance domain and health domain in every it company there are many business analysts right what do they mean by domain knowledge now if they want to develop a software for a bank they are supposed to know all sorts of banking activities all sorts of business activities that take place in a bank so there will definitely be a team of business analysts who know all about the business activities of a bank there will be another team of business analysts who know all about the activities that take place in the health domain so you need not worry about this domain so it is the duty of the people who have studied MBA. They will gather the business knowledge. They will convey to us both mathematics statistics people and programming people. And they will form the algorithm probably. And these people will implement the same. Now, once you learn data science, once you pick up the skills that I have just now mentioned, you will most probably join as a data science analyst after some time. If you have a lot of interest in research, a lot of interest in developing your own algorithm. So uh, take, a, take an algorithm, existing algorithms, uh, do some tweaks here and there and customize it. If you are well versed with this particular art, you will most probably be promoted as a research engineer. And sometimes you may be really very much interested in data. Nowadays, people talk about storing voluminous tons and tons of images videos and audios so it's not that easy to store such huge amount of right videos and audio files you have to think about cloud storage and all so if you are very much interested in that area you will be promoted as a data engineer now what is the right what is the similarity between data science and statistics now you know mathematics and statistics are related at the same time they are not the same subject right the msc mathematics is a separate course msc statistics is a separate course similarly there is a lot of relationship between these two subjects but they are separate msc data science is different from msc in statistics actually we have seen just now that these are the five steps 
involved in every data science projects now in all these five steps statistics plays a crucial role computer science also plays a crucial role that is why we say that is why we teach both statistics and computer science in the msc data science course now everyone talks about artificial intelligence also what do the people say during the next five years people will talk a lot about data science and artificial intelligence these are the two fields that are going to be at the top of the chart now these are the five activities that are involved in the field of artificial intelligence among these five activities the fourth and fifth activities are so popular now let us not get into the nitty gritty of the details but for the time being please remember the fourth and fifth activities are very important now and both these activities are very closely related to data science thank you